covering the news that matters to you. It's been a cloudy, foggy day to close out the work week. You can see flames from our tower, as you see on this video. Turn to Local News 8. Local News 8 in the morning continues. Welcome back. It is now 657. Here are your three things to know this morning. Number one, Pocatello Mayor Brian Blatt has announced Brent Nichols and Corey Mangum as his selections for the two vacant seats in the city council. Both will be considered during tonight's city council meeting. If they are confirmed, they will fulfill the unexpired term through December 2023. Number two, a preliminary hearing for Wayne Schwanevel, the former Soda Springs girls basketball coach accused of rape was postponed. A new hearing date has not been set. And number three, fire crews are steadily approaching full containment of the Moose Fire near Salmon. Fire managers announced it is now 80% contained as of the latest update. You can find these stories and more on localnews8.com and the Local News 8 app. Let's check back in with Jeff Roper. Well, thanks for watching this morning. Uh, as the kids head out to the uh, bus stop and get ready to get to class, it's going to be about 42 degrees. So a jacket is a must today. We'll see a few clouds roll in. We'll be in the mid to upper 70s for the day today. So we are just over our seasonal temperature by about 10 or 12 degrees. Uh, things are brightening up. We'll head toward 80 in Pocatello this afternoon. And then we have some uh, wintry showers that are in our future. So be back here today at noon as we track this for you. The timing on this and the potency of said Arctic air from the Alaskan Bay. Uh, we're, I, I gotta go out and buy some Klondikes to get in the mood for this. <laughs> it's gonna be about 76 in Idaho Falls for the afternoon. And we'll be hunkering down into the lower 70s, which is still about six, seven degrees above where we should be. So I would encourage you to go see leaves this weekend. They're supposed mm -hmm. to be peaking, and we're getting into that season where there's lots of things for sale in the store. In your honest opinion, what is the worst Halloween candy? Let us know. We'll be anxious to hear your answers. Thanks for joining us. See you at noon. A bag of salad would probably. <laughs>